On the 9th of November 2021, Paris and Cotonou saw a major event in the world history of African heritage. The restitution by France and the definitive return to Benin of a spectacular collection of 26 monumental pieces looted by the French army in 1892 and now returned to Cotonou, representing nearly 2.5 tons of material, spiritual, cultural and artistic history. For me, but above all for the history of the world cultural heritage of, of Africa, this restitution was an event of enormous significance. A few years ago, when restitution was still considered impossible, the then Minister of Culture of Benin said to me, if it happened one day, it would be like the fall of the Berlin Wall or the unification of the two Koreas. And that's how I feel now, arrived in a new time, in a time of radical breakthrough. No one, nobody, no one, three years ago would have imagined that this restitution would be possible. When Felwin Sarr and I began work on the 2018 uh, restitution report, we were always told that it was a mission impossible, mission impossible. Just as there was a before and after to the fall of the Berlin Wall, there will be a before and after to this restitution to Benin. A before and after in the world geography of African historical heritage, systematically and massively deported to, the, to Europe during the colonial era. A before and after in the relationship between those who for 100 years have had almost all of this heritage, that is France, Germany, Belgium, and Great Britain, and those who have had almost none, that is, the African countries themselves. European arrogance in the face of the legitimate desire of Africans to reconnect with their artistic, cultural, and historical heritage is a thing of the past. For more than half a century in France, Germany, Belgium, and England, administrations and museums have multiplied strategies, not only to prevent restitutions, but also to stifle the necessary public debate on the colonial provenance of works from Africa and elsewhere. The time for denial is now over. <laughs>